I'm Eric Wright from the 49ers, listening to Jim on Bass. Welcome back to another episode of the Jim on Bass Show. We're here at Ruby Hill with Eric Wright. And Eric, it's good to see you again. I think you've done all these tournaments for Kena, right, oh, through the yeah. years? I've been to every one of them, so this is, this is number 30. So yeah, so I've been uh, one when they first started over at, over in Tracy in the Goat Patch over there. You got a good street going, and I heard that uh, there's another Missouri guy here. Maybe Alden Smith might be showing up, right? Oh, okay, well, good, good for him. Uh, good guy. Well, I, I saw you at the Dwight Clark event a few weeks back, and when I see events like that, this tournament, does that help keep the guys all linked together? Well, it, it does. You know, it it gives guys. Uh, visual on guys to see how they doing catch up with you know with families and uh just make sure we just supporting all the all the good causes of uh, our ex guys and current guys and so that's what we do one of my other questions that i had uh you mentioned you're in the lumber business how's that going are you still in the lumber business yeah, hey man it's slow right now i'm in the lumber business so i you know i got we've got a couple forces out here from channel lumber and so uh and we've always aligned ourselves with with uh, relationships companies and everything so if it's a better uh, fit and get companies to uh, support whatever our guys are supporting that's worthwhile and it's a good event so that's what we do and since this is Keena Turner's event we're helping support the Boys and Girls Club of Tracy when you think back I know you're good friends but is there any certain memories or stories that come to mind when you think of Keener through the years well well I'll tell you what we got started with the boys club when we played we had the champs foundation and we used to give turkeys and toys at the hunters point boys club then it went from that then to when Keena moved out to Tracy so it was the girls and it's the YMCA girls and boys club over there I think so that that's the uh, evolution in everything and uh, Keenan has always been able to hog tie me in when he had a charity or we do things together. So and that's what we've always done for for forty some years. And ever since I talked to you last year, you mentioned Tony Lindsay singing anthems back in the day. I've seen him around at Giants games, Warrior games. Now, curious, uh, who do you like to see in concert? You mentioned I think Tina Turner, maybe Michael Jackson last time. Anybody get you excited to get you to a concert these days? Well, I, I went to see Tony at uh, Yoshi's about a couple months ago, so you know, I support support Tony because we know Tony, and uh, Tony Tony's Santa Clara guy, and that's how we met Tony. But uh, hey, man, I ain't got time. I got two little kids. I ain't got time to go to that man. I gotta go to work, punch the clock, go home, man. I got daddy daycare and I got bubbles baths. So so hey, man, I ain't got time for that. You in the full on dad life? Hey man, hey man I, this is my second, this is my second campaign with that. So, man, I'm just, you know, hey, old granddad with two little young kids, man. I gotta find time. Well, speaking of time, I'll let you have fun on the golf course today. It's good to see you again. Thanks for supporting a great cause. Right, thank you.